Say cheese. Say cheese. Brush your teeth. Wow. Okay, look. What hotel you know? Come to it. It's like $30 per person. Yeah, yeah we literally yeah. did everything. It's worth it. Can you see how much it comes? Welcome to another episode of Buenos Insight. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe and turn that post notification on. And if you're not, Ace is making all this noise. Welcome back. Hold on. We just hit 3K on YouTube, man. Shout out to everybody who subscribed. All our new subscribers. We appreciate you guys. We love y'all. Hope you continue to enjoy us because we got some heat. We made it to our cool hotel. This hotel is really cool. Nah, this hotel is lit. Okay, look. What hotel you know? Wait, let's give him a hotel tour first. A room tour. Okay. So, we got our entryway. We still got our stuff because we literally just got in here. This cool bathroom with a little barn door. That's so cute. These colors is really turning it. So nice. Come on with the... Look at this. Rose gold, cute little accent, shower, ace terrorizing already. So now we're going into the room. I really like this. It's kind of like a, I don't know, it low key give me like speakeasy vibes. But most rooms, the shower window goes all the way down to the floor. Then we have this. I don't know what this is for, but I'm pretty sure that's a light that we can turn on. Yeah, right oh cute then we have this locker like system robes Ooh, nice and plush too with the oh our view is not so great but i mean it's actually not great at all i didn't pay extra for a city view tell them what's the best part besides ace acting up what hotel you know gives you an alexa uh-oh, never mind, I don't need your assistance. So you can request room service and everything else through Alexa, and they have another cool feature that's connected to her, and I'm gonna show y'all that in a little bit. Anyway, we just ordered some drinks because we got some pizza on DoorDash, but it didn't come with any drinks, so we just ordered some drinks, and hopefully the robot, did we tell them about the robot? We didn't even tell them about the robot. We make a call to Alexa, or we call the front desk, and we ask them that we want toothbrush, towels, whatever the case, they send this robot to come up here and drop the stuff off. That's our room service. So it's gonna be crazy to see this thing actually come up and deliver something that we want or something that we need. Like I said, check that hotel out if you're coming to Chicago. Dope, all right? Super dope. So look, it's at the door. <laughs> it's crazy. You look under the door, you see this blue thing? Yo, this hotel is super dope, man. See the robot? Hold on. Come on now, five star. Come on now. I know that's right. Come on, Ace. <laughs> no, thank you. <laughs> All right, thanks again. No problem. <laughs> okay. But check this out. We're going to go ahead and eat. Chill, drink our ginger ale in a glass bottle with our ice mountain spring water. Never had that before, so I'm gonna go ahead and try that today. And yeah, we'll see you next day. <laughs> Good morning, Chicago. Just getting up. Ace woke us up because he's been up running around and stuff like that. Hey, babe, what's the weather gonna be like today? Alexa, what's the weather like? Currently, in Seattle, it's 48 degrees Fahrenheit with what? mostly sunny skies. Oh, Seattle, we ain't today, in Seattle. We can expect to... Alexa telling us the wrong information. Hey, Google, what's the weather like today hey, Google, in Chicago? Hey, Google, it's Alexa, what? baby. <laughs> right now in Chicago, Illinois, it's 71 degrees Fahrenheit with mostly sunny skies. Today's forecast degrees and a low of okay. 63 degrees. Take me back to Orlando. It's probably like 78 degrees right now. 
take me back. All right, well look, one of the perks of teleworking is you can telework anywhere. So I'm gonna go ahead and get some work done before we head out and I'm gonna leave you with these two. I ordered some room service, a little breakfast for Ace because we have breakfast or brunch plans rather at 11. So Ace is not gonna be able to wait that long. So we had to order him some oatmeal. Yep, and he's watching Blippi right now so you can hear that in the background. So Blippi, look man, I think you need to cut us a check because our son be watching you all day, okay? Period. All day, every day. So, you know, 10, 15, 20 cents, you know, whatever, okay? <laughs> anyway, I'm about to get to work because your boy not trying to get fired. If I get fired, that's the end of all of what we, whatever we're doing in life, okay? So, can't get getting fired, all right? Oh, no. <laughs> baby. Okay, I'm sorry. Give me a kiss today, baby. I love you. I'm really kind of blown. I think I should have paid for City View now because this view is not given what it's supposed to. I don't even know what we looking at. I'm excited to hit the streets. Right, Ace? You guys, I'm just amazed. Ace spilled something on the floor and I took a clothes wipe bin down and wiped the floor with this rag. There's no dirt. Like, there's no dirt. Wow. Mom, mom. What's going on you guys? Look, my little half day of work right now, well, kinda, is done. So I need to get myself together so we can head out, enjoy the day, enjoy the scenery. Amai, Amai. Ace is saying, come on. Come on where? Amai. Okay, yeah, somebody gotta go. So I'm gonna go ahead and take care of business. So we're gonna get dressed and get right back with you guys. All right, y'all. We were trying to hurry up and get out the hotel before check out. And now we are headed to, I think it's called The Bean. Y'all know that little Mom. sculpture that everybody went to in Millennium Park in Mom. Chicago. Talking about being cold, I brought sweatpants because Derek convinced me that it was gonna be freezing. I bought clothes for all weathers. It's hot out here. Derek, I think we're supposed to go over there. Cause obviously we don't know where we are going, so. We are here, we gotta go. Here. Not far, baby. Called the bean. What I guess, like, I don't know if that's what locals call it. I don't know. But everywhere else I see is called Cloud Gate. So I'm gonna call it Cloud Gate. Because I ain't from here. But you know, man, Chicago is beautiful, man. I ain't gonna lie. Like, I had my. <laughs> Have a little doubts about the weather because we coming from Orlando, you know what I'm saying? Look, people move to Florida, don't know how to act. They think just everywhere is cold. <laughs> you know, that's how people be like staring at us recording. I'm just gonna say, we're YouTubers. Yeah, yeah. Everybody stares at us, but this is what we do now. Yeah, all like, the time. it's so weird. Like, why do people stare at you when you're vlogging? Like, I, I hear a lot know. of vloggers say that, like, people just be staring at them. I don't know, though, but you know what, though? I get that more in like places like here though. Rather but than But that's I mean, that's kind of weird though because you would think that people would be vlogging like But in Florida though a lot of people vlog. Yeah, so or in Orlando. Yeah. yeah. What you see? Bird? Oh wow. Once upon a time you could be all around it, go under it and everything. Look, say cheese. Oh my okay. god. Hey, say cheese. No. If you don't want to be in it, that's fine. Ace, come back. I need to be on this side. The lighting. Man, the lighting right now is terrible because the sun is everywhere, but man, Chicago is beautiful. But to all the parents out there, if you have some kids that need to be in strollers, don't take them out. <laughs> because once you do, this happens. <laughs> and he doesn't want to get back in. This hot in the floor. I was just about to say that. This is crazy. I'm sweating. I, I put a whole rack of shea butter on, and then my body is soaked. Ace keeps running around in circles to all these different. Um, Wait! Look, 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 look. I'm tired. I'm tired. No. Whew. Ace, hey, come here. Come here. Come here. <laughs> smile. Absolutely. One, if you don't smile, you're going to get 
Yeah, no. this is super dope, man. What's this place called? This is the Enchanted Forest, but what is this park called? It's called Mag Daily or Daily. I don't know. Chocolate. This is crazy. Uh uh. Let's stay here. Let's stay here. We're going that way. No, we're going that way. We're going that way. Let's go. Where we going? That way. Yeah. It's hot. Nobody told us to come you. out here in the afternoon anyway. It was you that told us to come out here. Well, look. With these clothes on. Look. No. You brought, tell them you brought a whole winter look. coat. I brought a whole winter coat because when we came out here three years ago and during Thanksgiving, I was freezing. I was wearing long johns and a big pea coat. And I wasn't about to take any chances, okay? Y'all know I don't like the cold. See, being hot for me is okay. I'll drink some water, get under some shade, I'm good. But when I'm cold, man, I'm pretty sure you guys will say, all right, we're getting to some heat or something like that. No, mm -mm. Nope, I'd rather be hot and cool myself down than be cold and warm myself up. Just the just type of person I am. Unless I'm going to sleep, I like to be cold. So check this out, we just left the park. Park this. I don't ever so know we yet. went to Millennium Park, but inside of Millennium Park, we went to Maggie Daly. It's like a children's park. And Ace, as you can hear, he's cranky. He's tired. He's hot. He's hot. He's probably hungry. He's probably hungry. So, and we're hungry too. So we're gonna be on our way to the Navy Pier, get something to eat, and you know, we'll be back. Okay, so now we're back. Now we're on the way to the Navy Pier. We want to show you the good eats. You know us. Every video, we got to show you the good eats. I think we had one loss, and that was uh, Peach Valley. Oh, if you were going to say something else, I was going to say you must have forgot about Peach Valley. Nah, Peach Valley. <laughs> Peach Valley was tough. Peach Valley in Orlando. Um, I don't mean to just... Look, we eat good food, okay? So, you can trust our opinion about Peach Valley. I'm just beat. I'm hungry, I'm thirsty, I'm hot, which is all resulting in me being tired AF. AF. All right, we'll see you when we get there. So we are at Navy Pier, and we just got some food from the Beat Kitchen Cantina. You know, we are pescatarian, so it's really difficult to find food here, but we definitely found something. We got six fish tacos, splitting three and three between me and Zayn. Don't think I'm over here being greedy, I'm not, all right? And we got some chips and salsa. I probably prefer the chips and guac, but my wife wanted the salsa, so you know we out here. Nah, 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 that means, that means you don't know me, baby. That means you don't know me. <laughs> well, yeah, it's a cool vibe here. We just been walking around. We'll probably show you more of the scenery as we see. But we had to get some food. We're hungry, and then Ace is knocked out. So he's sleeping in the carriers and he's walking around with him. But Ace has been a piece of work. Every time he's hungry or any time he's tired, he just starts fussing. If we don't get him together, it's over. Our day is over. So okay with the purple chips. Purple tortillas with the okay with the salsa with the hey beautiful. Y'all know I'm a taco connoisseur, so we gonna see what it's Yep. <laughs> we yeah, we Yeah, we're about to get on the boat. Uh oh. Can I take a picture? It doesn't matter. I'm scared. What you scared for? With Ace. Ace gonna be all right. So we decided to get on the boat. Ace woke up and said, "Boat, boat." So now we're here. You ready to get on the boat? Huh? Ready to go? It's about to move. So come on. Woo. Ready? Zayna was scared. I was gonna sit on the side by the water, but she's like, no, no, I'm not about to get this fresh press wet. That's why you just need to put your head in a bun and just go. Huh. All y'all ladies know that when you get that fresh press, something about that fresh press activate bad. I'm not complaining, but you can't do fun stuff with that. So why don't you just wear your head in a bun? We ain't about to go jet skiing. I didn't know we was about to get on the boat. Hey, them legs burning up. <laughs> I know your legs burning up.
He said, mine, he's mine. Look, man, the speedboat was cool. You seen Ace and Zayna's hair flying everywhere. We're gonna let Ace get on a couple rides. Then after that, we're going to Willis Tower. You know that tall yeah, tallest building in Chicago. It's gonna be crazy. But right now, we're gonna get Baby Boy on these couple rides, man. It's all about the kids. It's all about the kids. Say cheese! Woo! Yeah. All right, y'all. So we left Navy Pier and now we are at our second to last stop in Chicago. We are going to the Willis Tower. Yep. How many feet up it did she say? I don't know, but I need some depends after this. Why? Because I may just on myself. Why? Because it's so hot up? There it is. Where? This one. Derek must not have been paying attention on the tour, y'all. The tallest building I know for sure in Chicago. But uh, yeah, that's where we going. Y'all, Chicago give me New York vibes, but just not like New York like sauce or New York feel. It just kind of looked like it. Hey, so you excited? You want a quesadilla? Let's go. Get in the next one. Oh, that's how you doing me? We supposed to be in this together. Forever. It's official in here. It's the bottom one. Boom. Come on now. <laughs> we obviously ain't from Chicago. Hey, it's going down. Uh -oh. All right, quick prayer because we're about to be on top of the tallest building in Chicago. So, God help us. Amen. Well, guys, we won't be able to get on the ledge, but we're still going to go up. We can still see the. Yeah. The city from the top, so we're still gonna go. Thank you. This is crazy, you guys. Okay, a lot of history in here. What's that? Oh, this is dope. They did this. Okay, you got to go through a whole exhibit. Whoa! First of all, this is super crazy. You guys need to come out here, man. Yeah, it's a vibe before you get all the way up to the top. This is real cool, man. Look at this. Why didn't we do this last time we were in Chicago? Man, this is beautiful, man. Look at Chicago. Hey, no. Okay. We see the Willis Tower. Oh, this is dope, man. And here's the ledge. We can't get into it because of maintenance, but we can be in this little area on the side. So we're gonna show y'all that when we get there. Huh, the antennas. <laughs> That's your cheese pizza. Mommy. Okay, let me take your pizza. Whoa. Mm. Hold on y'all, I'm about to block this real quick. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> you see it? You see it? You see it? Oh, okay. Okay. Thank you, thank you. Yep. Alright, so. Yes. Okay. So fat. Okay. Boo! Your mom, ah, you needed your mama back in your seat. This is where you need to be, okay? <laughs> yeah, yeah, you, you wild out with that one. That's dope. You know, I want something like this in my little closet. That's 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 real nice, you know what I'm saying? Whoa. And she gotta take a picture. Please, please, please. Can you see I'm a Chicago? Come on, Ace, come on. I'm not gonna lie to you, this is like a content creator's playground in here. I mean, there's so much artwork, there's so many things that you can take pictures, you can just learn the history of Chicago. This place is lit, and I hope that you guys are paying attention when you come to Chicago, come to the tallest tower. I don't know what the name is, but I'm sure I will pop it right there. Come to it. It's like $30 per person. It's worth it. It's worth it. Look at 
at the lighting. I feel so good in here. Like, I feel like Jimmy Fallon, holla at me, all right? Come on, baby. Okay, Ace won't sit down. He's sitting on top of my head. So we're getting on the elevator to get to the, what's called a skyscraper? No. Skyscraper. This is where we're, huh? This is where we gotta go. Oh my goodness. All the way. Watch as we pass by some of your elevators traveling the speed of more than 30 miles. It is. And now we're here. I think we made a bad decision. Welcome to Sky Day. This is crazy. So check this out, they're playing copyright music right now, so we're not trying to get hit with a copyright claim, so we're going to be showing you lapses of everything that's going on, so yeah, stay with us, tune in. Even though we couldn't get on the ledge, it was super dope. We rec highly, highly, highly recommend it. And we had to get up out of there because Ace was tripping, running around, screaming, crying. So we had to cut our little time short, but we definitely recommend that. So when you come to Chicago, Let's come to that. So that is it, people. We have finally finished everything that was on our Chicago bucket list, I guess. All of like the major things that I wanted to do, we got it done <laughs> in one day. So now it's on to the next destination, Chicago. It was really, really lit and I felt like I really needed this trip back to Chicago to make me appreciate it more because the last time I came, or the last couple times I came, it's been cold. Like I was saying before the camera died, last time I came, or a couple times I came, it's been cold. I was just flying in and I really didn't get to experience it. But now that it was warm and we could move about, it was lit. Like, I have a whole newfound love for Chicago. Like, it's beautiful. Ace's TV is really loud. But yeah, definitely 10 out of 10. Highly recommend a day trip, weekend trip, or whatever to Chicago to experience it all. It was definitely yeah, wow. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so the camera, like, really, really died on us all of that being said chicago was really lit period i don't know if that got cut off in the last trial when the camera was acting crazy but yeah it was super lit make sure you like subscribe turn that post notification on and send this to yo mama your daddy your sister your brother your auntie your uncle your grandma your cousins and your best friends too okay and tell them wait a this side mama, it's coming mama. with the heat you Rocking my Afrocentric hat, rooted to the motherland. If you're looking to purchase these hats, go on Afrocentric.net. Tell them Boydum's Insight sent you. You did.